Hello, my name is Don Dunscombe, and my wife Terry and I have been attending Messiah Lutheran for a couple of years now. We have two stories of generosity that I'd like to share. The first was in the late 70s when uh, Terry and I were serving a little church in Northern California. I was the music pastor slash youth pastor. <laughs> it was a small church. And in serving that church, there was a couple who befriended us. They invited us into their home on numerous occasions. We socialized with each other. Um, they took care of our young sons when we needed time away or if we were gone at a youth camp or anything that we needed help with, they were available for us. And their generosity with their time was important to us. While we were in their home, we saw them kid each other, tease each other, laugh, just have fun together. And um, I'm a pretty serious guy, so learning how to have fun was important, still learning. The second occurred later in life when we were serving a church in uh, Oregon. I was the music pastor then, uh, bigger church, so I was just overseeing music. And there was a couple that joined the staff and they certainly had the gift of hospitality among their other gifts. They had us into their home on many occasions uh, and their ability to make you feel special was just um, uh, amazing. You felt like you were the most important person in the world when you were in their home. And that really helped us through a difficult period in the life of that church. The um, learning how to have hospitality and give hospitality was important to us. We learned from them how to have people on our home how to care for people in the home, how to make people feel special when they were in our home was important to us. So we moved to Washington about three years ago and um, we are establishing relationships with several couples in the church, but now that the pandemic has hit, that's difficult and it's difficult to have people in our home. But we're hoping when the pandemic is, ends or is mitigated somehow, we can again, begin to have people in our home and express that gift of hospitality, that generosity of time, which we learned um, on those two situations that I've just explained to you. So thank you for listening, and we hope to see you in church sometime soon. Bye for now.